I'm opening 200 packs of Pokemon Paldean and Fates in search of the rarest shiny Pokemon in the set. There are over 150 secret rares, including shiny rares, full art, special illustration rares, and incredible looking gold cards. And the question is, how many of these rare Pokemon cards will we get? Oh my goodness. Hello. Inside of here, there's 200 Pokemon Paldean Fates booster packs. Literally just like stacked, just stacks of stacks of Paldean Fates. We're gonna open up all of these packs today and see what we get out of all 200 of these booster packs. Oh. This is so many. Like every single one of these stacks is just stacked. First pack of the day. And inside of these, we are looking for, there's so many awesome shinies. Like I said, there is a really sick special illustration rare Mew card that we'd be looking for. Also looking for the Charizard special illustration rare along with the Clive. But definitely let me know what y'all are searching for in the comments. Oh, first pack in and we already got a hit. We got a Wigglytuff baby shiny right there, a shiny rare. So the first pack of the day has our first hit of the day. One down, 119 baby shinies left to go. That's crazy, y'all. So this set, obviously, as we've done for the last few sets, we are going to be doing a complete binder challenge for Paldean Fates. Oh! Are you kidding? Second pack in, like first two packs, already got some bangers out of literally the first two packs. All things considered, there's 245 cards total. And like I said, over 150 secret rares. So this one is definitely gonna take us quite a while to complete, but I'm up for the challenge. So we'll be looking forward to getting any and all gold cards, special illustrations, EXs, baby shinies, oh, art rares. <gasps> little palmy oh my goodness dude first three packs back to back to back i don't know where we can go from here but this is uh this is looking pretty good can we go four for four the iconic pokemon four for four oh <laughs> <laughs> little baby we got a riolu baby shiny is this some sort of game is this a joke we have not had a single miss yet i know the pull rates are really really good in paldean fates but normally they're not this good this is suspicious next pack here and we've got a mobile of holographic because like the regular base set is 91 cards i have a feeling for the sake of our binder challenge we're actually going to complete that like the base set relatively quickly and then we'll just be left with all of the secret rares that we're still looking for which is going to be quite the task but i think it's manageable especially with starting off with 200 packs of cards oh my gosh Dude, dude! Oh my gosh! Legit! The two for one special, we got the Gloom Shiny Rare and the Palafin Art Rare. These packs are absolutely stacked. At the end of this unboxing, we'll actually do a recap to see how many hits we got in total out of the 200 packs. Right now, the odds are looking to be quite in our favor, but we'll also tally up and see how many specials and how many golds and all of that that we get as well, because this is such a large number of packs. Like, it might be kind of cool to, like, see statistically what our odds are there. So we got a Kilowattro. It literally doesn't stop. Seru Ledge right there and a Mankey and a Heat Rotom. Seru Ledge is one of the Pokemon featured on the booster pack art. So that's pretty cool right there. So far, so good. This is nuts, man. Here we go. We got a Mousehold Griever. Oh. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, Garidon EX Gold! Whoa! All right! Like, literally back to back to back to back hits. This is crazy. Get a look at this. I absolutely adore the gold cards in this set. We got this, like, gold and teal situation. But, y'all know I'm a big texture person. Look at the texture on this. It is super funky and actually, I'm trying to catch it in the light. Oh, there we go, in the right light. The teal part is actually just fully glossy with like this really cool, almost like glittery hollow foil pattern. And then the gold part is actually the part that has the texture on it, which is really, really neat. Literally less than 10 packs in and we already got all of this. I don't know how the rest of the unboxing is gonna go, but if it's like this, we are in for a treat. And you may have noticed that the current prices for some of these cards, I have pop 
up on the screen. Those are actually the current market prices from today's video sponsor, TCG Player. TCG Player actually sent all of the cards that were unboxing today, so huge thank you to them for making today's video possible. They currently have listings for every single card in the Paldean Fate set, plus you can pick up some sealed packs, promo boxes, code cards, really anything. And in addition to having an incredibly optimized and easy to use marketplace for trading cards, TCG Player actually collects real data on cards values over time, so you can see how the market price for any given Pokemon card changes all on their website. So be sure to check them out in the description and thank you so much TCG Player for sponsoring today's video. This is seriously so crazy. I really do think it's cool that you can like track, like literally track the uh, the value of these cards over time. And even for like Paldean Fates, like I know this set just came out recently, but you can even see how the price has fluctuated in the first few weeks of this set being out. Anyway, you'll see that continue to pop up, but let's go ahead and get back into it. Oh, Ponyard, cool. We got a Ponyard shiny rare right there. We're still holding out for the potential, the possibility that you could get three hits in the same pack. I don't even know if you call it an urban legend because I have not seen anybody have this happen, but of course we've gotten some two for one specials, but what we have not seen a single time, not once, is three hits in the same pack. Is it possible? Stay tuned to find out. If I had to pick like a top three that I want to appear, whoa, Charizard EX, all right. Is that our first EX? Wow, dude, that's wild. We literally got so much, look at all this stuff. And this is the first time we've gotten a regular EX. That's wild. Next pack we got, ah. By the way, because this is quite a large unboxing and I wanna make sure this video isn't like five years long, if there are packs that don't have any kind of crazy hit in them, they don't have, well, yeah, really any hit at all, we will most likely, oh, little baby Knackly. We, and the double, Double Air Fryer Supreme, all right. Little baby, so we got another little baby. I was gonna say, if there are any packs that don't have hits in them, we are most likely just gonna skip them. I'll edit, like literally just edit right over them. So if you're watching this at this point, like at the beginning, we genuinely were back to back getting hits. As we continue to go through this unboxing, if you see us getting now back to back to back hits, it's most likely because I'm editing the video so that it's not 20 years long. Gardevoir, dude, but still regardless, I guess we're getting the hits. It doesn't even matter. Get ready for the feature-length film that is the Chaldean Fates unboxing. Oh! Nimona Full Art, all right. Dude, so we're getting a lot of new cards here. I'm actually, I'm super stoked that I don't think we've gotten a single repeat yet. Now that I've said that, we might start getting some repeats. I have a feeling once we get down to the wire here, like toward the 200th pack, we may see some of these full arts and stuff more than once because there's really only so many, but the baby shinies, we're really hoping to get a diverse spread of those because while they are like a little bit easier to pull, there's also a lot of them. All right, next pack here. Oh, Annihilate. Not. Oh, and? Ah, uh, and? Ah, uh, oh, Primeape. Dude, this one is funky. I did not know what a shiny Primeape looks like. Look at this guy's feet. Yo, why is he posed like that? Boy been working on the hammies and glutes. Dude, we've legit gotten so much awesome stuff and we have not even put a dent in these packs. Like literally, look at this. We just barely got started. And I feel like we've gotten some crazy stuff already. I was wondering how rare those gold cards were gonna be because we did a couple of box breaks this past week. Hey, Fortress EX. We did a couple of box breaks this past week and I did not pull a single gold card. In my head, I was like, oh my gosh, this is gonna be so rare. These are gonna be the ones that take us the longest to get. We got a Lantern, a Fiddle, and a Mag Mortar. What the heck? We're looking for our first full art shiny as well. Ooh, got a full art Clive. Super duper Clive is in the building. Just for scientific purposes here. Is this literally me? Oh, I'm sorry, we were trying to reach super duper Clive. <laughs> Do I need a haircut? Like I was saying, we haven't gotten a single full art Pokemon yet, which is weird because we've gotten like a gold, we've gotten so many full art trainers so far. Oh, Sarah Ledge. <gasps> oh no, this is the start of Dia de los Duplicates. I'm not ready, I'm not built for it. Sarah Ledge, Baby Shiny, all the cards that we don't pull. Ideally, we're gonna be trading like the cool stuff that we do get like a duplicate of and we'll be trading that for the stuff we don't have. You know, in the Pokemon trading card game. That's how they do it, I think. Let's see what we got out of this one. We got Nimona, Cottony, and a Fortress. All right, here we go, rapid fire. Three, two, one, boom, ah, and boom, ah, and, oh, 
Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Pew, 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 pew. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. We got a little baby Wiglet. Look at him. I love little Wiglet. He's great. Quick update. Unorganized stack. That is a lot of hits, and we still have a ton of packs. Next pack here. Bum, 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 bada, bum, 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 bada, bum, 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 Wait, 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 ah. Another one. So, there's actually two Paldean student cards in this set. However, that is the one that we pulled at the start of the unboxing. So, duplicate on the Paldean students. However, we are going to keep our eyes peeled for that second rendition of the full art Paldean student. Thought it was pretty cool that they included two of them in this. No way. Another one? Chill, 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 chill. Okay, we got an artisan and... Oh, what? No, no shot, dude. Another gold Coridon EX. Dude, I really did jinx us in saying that we weren't going to get any duplicates. The Dia de los Duplicates is underway. Coridon EX gold is our second gold. We literally have only pulled two golds and they're the same gold. Bada bing, bada boom. At least we're getting hits. So what's still lurking from our big stack of wonder and whimsy is a full art shiny and a special illustration rare, either the trainer special or the shiny Pokemon special illustration rare. We got a Squawkabilly EX. So there's a handful of each. There's a handful of trainers. There's a handful of Pokemon characters. I think the Clive special is the coolest of the trainers. And then I keep seeing people pull the Mew special and it's like driving me crazy that we have not seen it in any of our unboxings so we'll keep our eyes peeled for that mew let's go ahead and get into the next one there's no way there is no way i have never seen so many gold cards in my life this is nuts hold on hold on hold on what is that what is that what is that what is that oh my gosh dude let's go Maridon EX Gold. This was literally the number one gold that I wanted. Maridon EX. That is fantastic. I don't know what's going on. It is back to back golds. We've literally struck gold. It is Gold City USA. Look at that bad boy. Wow. Really, really good odds on the gold cards today. This is, this is redonkulous. I don't know what's going on. This is fantastic. I've been looking forward to doing this unboxing. Oh my God. Another one. The, I can't, I don't even know what to say. This is the third Paldean student. I have been really, really looking forward to doing this unboxing because this set has so many sick arts in it. And this is just so exciting. Not the third Paldean student. So we got a Kilowattro and a Weavile. Oh, that's sick. I love the colors on that. Weavile, shiny rare right there. I know I mentioned this in some of our previous unboxings. I have not mentioned it in this video. The texture on these baby shinies is awesome. Like there's just so much going on in the background here. The little stars get their own special texture. Like there's like kind of like a little swirly one going on in like the actual silver background as well. And then the silver border of the card actually gets texture too. It is textured out, gang. These are looking really, really good. Let me know if you guys have been finding any Paldean fates in the wild. And let me know what your polls have been like. Have you been getting any of those cards on your chase list? Any of those big chases from the set? We got the Skip Loom, Baby, and the Palafin. You know, that is something we haven't seen a ton of this unboxing is the art rares. And a Skip Loom, Baby, right there. Now, let me double check. We did already get the Palafin. However, I was worried we already got the Skip Loom. We actually got the Gloom. Easy mix up, but they are very different Pokemon. So, all right. Right. Here's just a little glimpse at what we've gotten thus far. And we've still got plenty of good stuff to go. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> bro. This ain't it. What the heck is happening? Our fourth Paldean student, specifically Paldean student number 230. How is this possible that we've literally gotten four of the same one, but we literally haven't seen a single of the Paldean student number 231? That is perplexing. I am obsessed with this cat. I literally, I love her so much. Okay, it's time for the Rafiki halftime show. <laughs> I think she's in a silly, goofy mood right now. I also didn't realize cats sleep for a, a colossal, an astronomical amount of time. I thought they took quite a few naps, but this cat just snoozes. It's just she gets up and goes some, sits somewhere and takes a nap. And then when she gets up from that nap, she just walks somewhere else and then takes another nap. It's crazy. Never seen anything like it. She reminds me of myself. Here we go. Next pack in. We got a net. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Nest Ball, we got a Charmeleon. Oh, Gardevoir EX Full Art. That's sick. We got a Mastiff and an Executor. That is our first. This is crazy. That is our first full art Pokemon Shiny of the day. I was getting a little worried. I was like, did we get some error packs that literally have no full art shinies? Out of this big stack that we've already acquired, that is the first time we've seen a full art shiny, regardless of getting th literally three golds already. Now that Gardevoir also has a special illustration rare, which would be awesome to see in today's unboxing as well. Oh, Rabska, baby shiny, and Moonlit Hill. This is actually, speaking of the Gardevoir, this is a very useful stadium card. If you're actually playing the trading card game that you can use in your Gardevoir deck so really really cool stadium right there that one i believe is one of the new cards that has come out with this set oh that one opened so weird camera up skip one wait 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 another one. one all right Ooh. Ooh. oh pidgeot ex cool all right we got a pidgeot ex full art that's sick i really really like this one pidgeot shiny looks awesome so now that we finally got one shiny full art the others will just they'll just show up tinkaton Ooh, tinkaton awesome all right look at that hammer it's hammer time whoa whoa Anyway, <laughs> you can finally start to see some of the playmat again here. Ooh, pile of fin. Gengar, Oink Lan. Ooh, River of Room. Room, River of Room, shiny rare. I like the, the gold and purple situation. It looks real nice. I would say we are getting close to the halfway point. I really don't think we're actually there at the halfway point. We still have a ginormous, like over a hundred packs to open. We got Noivern EX right there. I believe that's our first Noivern. And then like I mentioned at the end of this unboxing, like once we're done with all 200 packs, we will go ahead and do a recap to show y'all all of the hits that we got. In addition to that, I'm going to get together a spreadsheet to show like basically the pull rates for all of these cards which should be really interesting to see. We got the Paldean Clodsire EX right there. All right, so getting our fair share of EXs here. Pineco, baby, shiny, Professor's Research, and an Annihilate. We got a little Pineco. <coughs> oh. Ah. What's up, Rafiki? Yes. I guarantee she's hungry. So we've got a Graplock, Nimona's Backpack, Kilowattro, Alakazam! All right, cool. Alakazam EX Full Art Shiny. Let's get a look at that. Really, really sick right there. I love that Alakazam. Bro, these stacks are crazy already. <laughs> Golden Go. <laughs> Charcadet. <laughs> Greybird. Boo. All right, we got a Clive, Oink Lone, Tana Mouse, Curlia, and a Nimona Full Art. So at this point in the unboxing, here's the thing. I think we're getting a lot of duplicates when there are still a ton of cards that we have not seen yet. So Nimona is actually a duplicate trainer full art that we got right there. That one is awesome. That one is also available in a special illustration rare. So Primate, Whimsicott, Scrafty, a Bisharp right there. Awesome. This is definitely a new one. I know we got the Pawnee art a little bit earlier on. Our baby shiny stack is stacking. I really feel like the odds for these packs are so good. Like generally, at least for like regular everyday standards, you'll get like one out of every three packs will have a hit in it. Like a, you know, like an EX or something. And back in the old days, one out of every three packs would have a holographic. You remember like the Wizards of the Coast era stuff. However, these ones feel like they are really, really good odds that you're going to get a hit. That is a shiny or an EX or something like that. I would say it's strong, like it's over 50% chance. I don't know what the exact odds are, but like I said, we will go ahead and get those odds at the very end of this unboxing, at least for our lot of the 200 packs we have today. We got a Swoobat here and, oh, a Glamora EX. Awesome. Charmeleon and Zatu right there. Nice, man. Glamora EX full art. Grap lock. We got a pine co. Oh, Gardevoir EX. All right. We got the Gardevoir EX special illustration rare right there. That is awesome. So we did manage to get the Gardevoir EX full art along with the shiny Gardevoir EX special. That is sick. I absolutely adore this. And the texture on it is buck wild. Once again, we're big texture people. 
Love a good texture on there. This one is sick. That is our first special illustration rare of the day. Crafty. Oh, oh is that another one? Another one? I think it's a shiny full art. Oh, Pidgeot EX. All right, we got another Pidgeot EX here. Next pack here. An electric generator. We got a grab locked Iono and a Luxio. Oh man, dude. All right, we're on a roll here. Luxio, baby, shiny right there. That one looks awesome. It's so reflectivey. That's incredible. So I hope you guys are enjoying the video thus far. If you are, don't forget to drop a like. It does let me know that you want to see even more videos like this one. We got oh a Pakarisu, sick. All right, Pakarisu, baby, shiny right there with the little pink ears and pink tail. I dig it, I like it. Two electric type baby shinies in a row. Maybe Pikachu will be in our near future. Should be noted, the most sought after baby shiny, the shiny rare, is the Pikachu, which is currently allegedly more sought after than like half the special illustration rares. And it's like, it's a baby shiny. But I think it's just because there is so many shinies and it's obviously like, you know, the iconic, the mascot of Pokemon. Makes sense. Zatu and a squawkabella. I heard the bird is the word. Oh, well, everybody's heard about the bird. <laughs> Yay, the small imp. Oh my gosh, I was so excited about this one. So the shiny small imp has a black olive on the top. It's so cute. I really like this one. I think black olives are better, so that's probably why. <gasps> that's not even true. I like all olives equally. Except for the ones that have the garlic stuffed in them. Those ones get special treatment. I love a good garlic stuffed olive. We got a Neuvern EX. All right, so lots of EXs coming out of these packs. All right, we got another hit here, Fortress EX. Feeling good about this one, gamers. This one feels thick. Huh. Great Tusky X, that is a pretty big boy. That's a pretty big boy. Ooh. No way we got a third pine cone. What the heck is up with this? We're gonna have a whole yard of pine cones by the end of this one. Nest ball whimsicott. Oh, we got wugged. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Beep, 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 beep. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. This is not our first rodeo seeing the art rare Wug Trio. We got so many Wug Trios in our previous video. Don't worry, we gave away all the cards, so I actually gave away all the Wug Trios. But I felt like we were being trolled because it was just like straight up. It was back to back Wug Trios. It was so weird. Moving on here. But now I hope a bunch of them don't just start randomly popping up. Dude, this is. This is sick. This is this is not gonna happen. This it this is not how this goes. The start of the wug. So we got the wiglet and the wug trio. We did actually already snag this wiglet. Really cute, but coincidentally right after the wug. Hmm. That's suspicious. That's weird. Whoa! We got a baby sneasel right there. <gasps> and a penny! Alright! Penny illustration rare and a Sneasel in the same pack. The two for one special, it strikes again. This is the Penny special illustration rare. Oh man, that one's sick. With the awesome Eevee backpack here and she's like holding up a Pokeball, you know? All sophisticated, she's got that awesome hair. I love that card, so that's great. And then the Sneasel baby shiny. I know we got the Weevil a little bit earlier, Weavile. So really nice, we actually got both of those as well. That is our second special of the day. Let's see if we can continue our good luck. Oh, cool, Snover baby shiny right there. The luck continues with a cute little baby Snowy. An Ultra Ball Mousehold Charmander. We also got a Barboge. Oh, Pal Dance! Is this, this is the same one. How is this happening right now? This is, are you serious? Dude, let me know if anybody else out there is having this issue. This is our fifth, is that right? Our fifth Pal Dance student. The same one, there's two different arts. We got five of the same art and none of the other art. What are the odds of that? That is super weird. I don't know. Nemona's backpack. We also got a Primeape. Oh, Squawkabilly, EX Shiny, Sarah Ledge, and an Exeggutor right there. Cool, all right. Keep doing your thing, Squawkabilly. Keep doing your thing. Do your thing, 21. Do your thing, 21. Paldean and Clodsire right there. It's gonna be the one, guys. This is gonna be the one. I know my Mew EX is in here. All right, we got the mouse hole Paldean student, and there's nothing. Gengar, oh, Slowbro, sick. Slowbro baby shiny right there. Mimikyu Hollow, we still haven't seen that Mimikyu shiny rare yet. 
This is great. There's slow bro. There's also a slow poke in here. We'll keep an eye out for the slow poke as well, but it's great that we got the slow bro little kind of like purple, purple and gold situation on the slow bro. Oh, 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 what is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, Nimona! All right, we got the Nimona special illustration rare. That is sick. Look, at we got Palmot in the background too. Just killing it. Look at his fluffy little hands. This is great. Another one where the Pokeball is very prominently placed. Seriously? The prominently placed Pokeball? I wonder if this is like, this had to be intentional, right? It seems very deliberate that it's like in the center of the card on both of them. I don't know. Pretty cool that we got another one. So, so far out of our unboxing, we've gotten three specials, two of which are trainers, one Pokemon here, Squawkabilly EX regular. I was just talking about how I was like, oh my gosh, I love the green shiny on Squawkabilly. Literally, it's already green. It's the, the little hair poof that's different. The little floof that he woofed. Okay, we got the Clive Charmeleon King Gambit. Dude, we got the full line. Fantastic. Oh, and a Palafin. And bada bing, bada boom. I think that's our first, like, I guess, line of Pokemon that we've completed. Check that out. All right, so we got the Pawniard, Bisharp, and King Gambit. My floor right now, y'all, is just covered in booster packs. There is a trash bin down here but the rest of the floor is just all booster packs. Oh, Relor, we got a little dung beetle boy. That's a, that's a big ball. That's a big ball of something. Three, two, one. Ah, that's tough. All right, let's see if we got anything. Three, two, one. Oh, Star You! Wait, that one's great. I kind of forgot this is what shiny Star You looked like. That's awesome. I love like the mint, almost like a like a sea foam situation. Really nice. Great tusk EX right there, dude. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think so we've gotten a lot of brand new cards for the binder but the number of like duplicate EXs I was actually not anticipating oops I guess that's what happened oh Tatsugiri I guess that's what happens when you open like 200 packs it's a lot Tatsugiri baby look it I really like this one all right and onto our next pack here we've got Curlia oh Pidgey yay we got the Pidgey baby shiny right there this one surprisingly was one of the more pricey baby shinies that i saw on tcd player like for strictly value this one was very high up there i believe the pidgey shiny rare was actually more valuable than the pidgeot ex full art which is crazy to think about but i'm super happy that i have both of these now we're just looking for that pidgeotto to complete our line there Ooh, curlio we got a paldean student pikachu and <laughs> This is, this has got to be some kind of sick joke. Why does it gotta be like this? All right, next pack here. I think I see something good in here. Got the Ultra Ball, Winklin. Oh, Squawkabilly EX. Oh, yo, yo, the Iono special illustration rare. Dude was hiding back there. This was our chance, guys, to get the three for one special. That would have been diabolical if we would have got like an EX or a full art in that last spot. Once again, I don't even know if that's possible, but the fact that this is possible is enough for me. A full art shiny Pokemon along with a special illustration rare trainer. I really, really like this card. Colors on it are cool. Like the style of the art is really interesting. And you've got like a whole number of Pokemon on here. You, know, you got Miss Magius, Belly Bolt. I see a Luxio down here, a Watril. I'm sure there's some other ones lurking, but overall I think the style is pretty cool. It's almost like she's like vlogging while on vacation or something you see these palm trees she's like working remote or something i don't know i think that's pretty cool Ooh, that's our first judge judge full art right there it just never stops it just doesn't stop when will it end say it ain't so i will not go turn the light off carry me home no 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 we got our raichu all right raichu shiny rare right there oh, look at him look at him go little zippy zappy guy you love to see it you really do i have to admit my cheeks hurt a little bit from smiling so much i like 
there's certain moments in time when this happens. Generally, it's when I'm at like a convention, talking to people all day, recording videos, like you're yeah, doing like meet and greets, talking to my viewers and stuff, where I'm like literally, I'm smiling all day. And right now, this is one of those times. We've gotten too much awesome stuff in this unboxing. I think it's a, yes, it's literally a sign. My cheeks hurt. Don fan right there. We got a nest ball. Oh, Pawniard baby shiny. We also got a Clobopus and a Mimic Yo. This is how many packs we have left, by the way. The numbers are dwindling. Roughly 50 to 60 packs left. Yo, the Don Dozo strikes again. Look at all these Don Dozies. Camera opt. Ooh, Moonlit Hill. Whooper. We got a little Paldean Whooper. How cute. All right. Look at him. I really like this one. I think this Pokemon is so adorable. Next pack here. Oh, oh, oh. We've got a Kilowattrel Curlia. Gengar, definitely, definitely see something here. Oh, Peldane and Clodsire. Wait, that's perfect. No way we got the Wooper and the Clodsire. Have I gotten this one yet? I think this is a new one. The perfect little duo right there. Peldane and Wooper and Peldane and Clodsire. I love this little meatloaf, dude. He's so cute. It would have been cool to see him with like the little back spike things like extendoed, but I think that that design they went with is pretty neat too. It's kind of silly. It's a silly Pokemon for sure. Halifin. This one is showing up shockingly more often than any of the other art rares and I'm, I'm not saying that lightly I mean like it's really really showing up more than the other art rares we literally only got one of each of these the wug trio and the palmy and then just a mountain of palafins once again into the dia de los duplicates if it was like October or November that joke would be so perfect it really does not make sense for a February video but <laughs> that's beside the point wug trio yo I spoke too soon Dude, the wug has returned. We've gotten all of them except for the Paldean soon. There's actually only five trainer full arts. I thought there was more for some reason. And we've really taken a good chunk out of these specials here for the trainers, which is great. Still holding out on this pup. Once again, these two, the Mew and the Charizard, are gonna be some spicy meatballs to trade for if we don't end up pulling them today. And then there's still all of these golds. We currently have just gotten these two, but there's still four other gold cards that we haven't seen yet. Man, oh, we haven't gotten the Mew yet either. And there's still so many that I would love to see in today's unboxing. Mew EX Full Art, the Ditto here. Snorlax would be awesome as well. The Lechonk would be great to see. Hoping for the best as we continue to round out our packs. All right, we got a Lantern, Oink Lone, Curlia, Chinchow. Oh, wait, this is it. Hold up, is this the guy? This is the guy, that's crazy. Like literally, I mean the fact that we just had a whole detour and looked through the, the booklet to make sure this was the last one and then literally the following pack pulled it. That's a weird coincidence, I appreciate it. So this is the other Paldean student card right here. So we did end up securing both of them in today's unboxing, that's fantastic. You'll love to see it, let me know which one of these that you like better. Also let me know what your favorite card from this entire set is. Additionally, if it's different, let me know what your chase card Card is your one single card that you really really would love to get and I uh, can't wait to look through those comments and see what everybody's searching for what products you guys are looking forward to see coming out or any other comments that you have about the Paldean Fates set this is like a really really solid look at the cards and the set list because this is such like a large number of packs I think we'll get a look at a lot of different stuff here today we got a golden go and a great tusk I'll tell you what I actually opened a fresh pack of card sleeves for this video that last full art that we got was actually the one 100th pull, the 100th hit out of this entire opening. So this is the 101st hit that we've gotten out of our 200 pack opening. I was not prepared for this. I wasn't ready. All right, here we go. Next pack. Let's see if we can get three in a row here. They got some spicy meatballs. Oh, Paldean Whooper baby. All right, so that's our second Paldean Whooper there. Our second little baby. It's our second child. Oh. All right, we're going for it. Rapid fire, three, two, one. Whoa. Bruh. I'm doing that again. I need a redemption round. <laughs> All right. Three, two, one. Pew. Ah, Skawaka Belly. So we did for sure get all of the art rares right here. You got these three that are in the regular set and then the Mimikyu promo. And Oinklin. Oh, Alakazam EX. Cool. All right. Not too shabby, Mr. Zam. I'm out of control, I tell ya. Oh. Ooh. Drifloon. Apparently the lore with Drifloon is you don't want to hold on to it because something bad will happen. You'll be floating away with Drifloon. Something bad will happen. You go straight to Lavender Town is what I heard. On to the next. Oh, whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
Oink Loon and the LeChonk shiny. I love how many pink shinies they put in here. This one is super cute. Based on what we got so far, I think we've gotten some absolutely incredible stuff. If I'm being ambitious, I'm gonna say we're gonna get at least one more special illustration rare, at least two more shiny Pokemon full arts, and at least two more gold cards. That's a that's steep on the gold cards, but we started so strong with those that I, I'm feeling confident we can get some more golds as the unboxing continues. We got a oh, there we go, <gasps> Mew EX, yay! Okay. This is the Mew EX Full Art. I absolutely adore this card. This is definitely my favorite EX Full Art, as well as, like I sa I've been saying, this whole unboxing. I would love to get the special of this, but I'm super happy that we got the shiny Full Art Mew, that blue Mew. You'll love to see it. You really do. You can tell she's from a streamer household. She's out cold. I'm, I'm here pulling hits left, right, and center. And she's just snoozing, just having a good time. Y'all, I can confidently say that this is the longest I've ever been filming for one of our 200 pack booster pack openings. I've literally, I'm not even joking, I've been sitting here for over two hours. Like, it's been over two hours since I started filming this video. Anyway, just wanted to let y'all know this one is definitely gonna be a long one, but most notably because we're getting a lot more hits and stuff, so. It's the final brain cell. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't seen that one yet. All right, Pikachu pack right here. Let's see if we can get the Pikachu shiny. I want to see the Pikachu baby. Ha! Ah. We got a Don fan. Oh, Knuckle Stack. All right. That's a fresh one. This one straight up looks like it's like out of Minecraft or something. The knuckle stack. Look at all these little brick things. Here's our brick. Pokemon. Hey, Ralts, what's up, dude? All right, we got the Ralts baby right there. So I think we're just missing the Curlia then for our, our little trio here because we definitely got the Gardevoir EX full art and of course just got the cute little blue Ralts. I love that one. Whoa. Oh, oh, what the heck? All right, back to back pack of lax. We get the Ralts and then we got another Gardevoir EX Full Art. So I think we definitely hit our quota on the shiny Full Arts right there. We got another one. All right, Espathra right there. Espathra EX Terrastalized. All right, we got Moonla Hill, Charmeleon, a Doxmont. Dude, another. another one? What the heck is going on? Another Alakazam. We were we were chilling on Alakazam. I think we had one. And I was like, ah, oh, this is sick. Awesome. We got one Alakazam. Now I think we got at least three. It is just weird because like we haven't gotten all of the full arts yet, but some of them we got two or three or maybe even five of. Or six. I think it was six actually. I can't even remember. Oh, sick! Lucario right there. Awesome, we got a Lucario shiny rare to go with our Riolu. That's great, all right. Cool, look at him doing his little kick. Pah. I've seen people do videos where they're like open packs of cards and then they'll go and shiny hunt those Pokemon in the game. And I have to say, y'all have more patience than I because I can barely shiny hunt in the, the car. I'm looking for the Mew. We're not getting the Mew. We've opened up almost 200 packs and I haven't seen my son. Where is my son? Well, at least we we actually did get the shiny Mew. We just, oh, Scizor. We just didn't get the, the special one yet. The other one is special, but it's not the special illustration, right? You know, <laughs> nothing. It is down to the wire. Oh, Murkrow. Oh, that one's sick. I didn't even know that was in here. Hello? That's awesome. Murkrow, shiny rare right there. Oh, that's great. I love the purple on it. It fits this one super well. Like, that could be the regular colors of this Pokemon, and I wouldn't say anything. All right. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Nothing. Three, two, one. Ah. All right, we got a camera up, Scrafty. Oh, Garganackle, cool. We finished off that line with the Knackly, Knackle Stack, and Garganackle. Fantastic, darling. Look at all these. This is, the recap's gonna go buck wild. The trifecta right there, fantastic. Here we go. I think it's time. I think it's time that we bring in Resident Growly and we boop these on Growly Snoot for good look. Boop, boop. There we go, I just do a little, a little multi-boop sequence. A little pop, 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 pop. Let's see if we can finish strong with one of those chases we are searching for. Gengar, we got a technical machine. Ooh, a Dolive, great, awesome. Oh, yo, 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, man, that's sick. I did not even see that I was blindsided by the gold. That is fantastic. A gold Chiyu EX along with the Dollar Baby Shiny. I genuinely cannot wait to set up my binder for this. I know it is going to be super chaotic. Once again, there's more secret rares in this set than there are regular cards in the base set. So I think it's going to be really, really interesting to see how long it takes us, how many trades it takes us to actually complete this set. Because I know we're going to get a lot of cards from this unboxing for sure. Cyclazar right there. All right, we got a Charmeleon Ultra Ball. Noibat. Oh, look at him. Oh my gosh, I love it. The Noibat shiny. He's just a little green guy. Kind of like a mint spearmint situation. All right, we got a mouse hold. Oh, Arctivax. Cool. Arctivax shiny rare right there. And Artisan and a Ruff Ruff Room. Arctivax. Arctabax does whatever and Arctabax does. The Frigibax one is overwhelmingly cute. This one is great. Uh, I don't think I've seen the Baxcalibur one. Actually, I probably have and I just don't remember, but I'm assuming the color scheme is generally the same, so I dig it. And here we are. Everybody, this is the very last pack. This is the 200th booster pack of Pokemon Paldean Fates that we have opened today. This has been the craziest unboxing. We've gotten so much awesome stuff. And once again, we're going to do a recap to go through all of the stuff that we have gotten. But this is it. It all comes down to this very last booster pack to see if we can secure one more big hit out of our Paldean Fates 200 pack opening. Here we go. We got a Moonlit Hill, a Don Fan, Atticus, Fido. We've got a Gengar and oh, Fortress EX. All right, we finished strong with an EX Pokemon right there. 200 packs. I'll just show you how many hits we got out of this unboxing. Let me stack them up here. These, y'all, that's all hits. Are you kidding me? This is all hits. To be honest, you know we didn't even come close to completing the set. That is crazy. This is what we got out of 200 packs of Paldean Fate. You got the golds, the specials, the full arts here. Continue on into the trainer full arts. Uh, the art rares. Once again, quite a few palafins there. We've also got all of these baby shinies. And not only all of those here but it continues on into the next stack. All of these baby shinies as well, all right? Including a, a few duplicates, not like a crazy amount of duplicates, which I'm happy about. And then of course, all of these EXs as well. It just does not stop. That is so, so many awesome hits that I'm super happy to add to the collection. In total, we got 129 hits out of our 200 packs, making our pull rate a strong 64.5%. Wow. We got a total of 35 EX cards, 13 art rares, 47 shiny rares, 26 full arts, four special illustration rares, and four gold cards. I'll have the percentages up on the screen so you can see our odds for pulling each type of card, but all things considered, the odds are pretty fantastic with this set. Thank y'all so, so much for watching. I do hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to drop a like. Let me know what you thought. Let me know what your favorite moments was. Let me know what cards you are chasing from Paldean Fades. Also, once again, huge thank you to TCG Player for making today's video possible. We will have our Paldean Fates binder challenge coming very, very soon. Stay tuned for that, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!